first and foremost, how are you doing now that everything's done filming? It's finally airing. Like, how are you dealing with the social media and the DMs and all of that craziness? Yeah, I think at first uh, it was kind of quiet. So I was able to respond as much as I could. And again, very just appreciative for the whole opportunity. So I wanted to be able to let people know, like, hey, like, thank you for reaching out. It means a lot. Uh, then the first episode aired and all of a sudden it's like, it's just like open the floodgates. And at that point, uh, I started to get overwhelmed and yeah, I wouldn't, I'd be lying if I said it was all, you know, sunshine and roses. I have definitely fallen victim to reading everything, which again, everybody's told me stop reading all the mm -hmm. comments, but I, my thought was if I know what's out there, there's no surprises. Uh, what I found those again is now I'm watching the show and I see the comments and I understand a lot of these thoughts that people are throwing out there on the internet. And they're saying, well, we're not seeing this and we're not seeing that. And I'm seeing a lot of this for the first time myself. Uh, just, I mean, I'm sure we'll jump in some of the episodes, but like the last episode uh, with what all had happened with the drama, I didn't even know that was going on. And so like, I'm watching it now for the first time and I'm like, wow, okay this was all happening while I was off talking with other women. And I had, I had seen that and, and, and realized what was ha occurring. I think I would have responded to it. I mean, I, I know I would have responded to it, but people have to understand. I didn't see that. I'm actually mm -hmm. now watching it for the first time with everybody else. And so it's news to me, a lot mm -hmm. of what I'm seeing now. And that's, it is challenging because again, I see people that are coming after me and my character and saying, this guy has terrible judgment. Why wouldn't you respond to this? And the answer is, you know, it's simple. It's like, do you see me in that picture? Like do, when they're, when they're showing the drama, am I there present? And the answer is no. So I didn't know about it. I was left in the dark. I only knew what the women brought to me. And Again, like what I'm seeing is like a lot of what was happening. I just kind of got bits and pieces through the conversations I had. Right. Yeah. And I think what people need to remember is there's one of you and about 30 women. So the ratio is off. You're mm -hmm. not going to be part of every single conversation in every single room. And I think how you said it is perfect. Like if you don't see Clayton in the room, that means he probably wasn't privy to what was happening in it. And yeah. I know that even as a contestant, you know, I remember getting DMs being like, well, why didn't you stick up for this person? Or why didn't you speak up in this situation? And I had a similar experience where a lot of drama happened the week of my one-on-one -on -one date and I, w I wasn't in the room. So it was like, you can't be held accountable for your actions when you weren't present to even act. 